Wagner are going crazy and have expressed intentions to invade Poland. Belarus has reported that Wagner's ambitions are causing them stress, as the group is pressuring them to strike Warsaw. Belarus claims to have urged them not to proceed and is finding it challenging to control their actions. The capable Polish military stands ready to respond, and any members of Wagner attempting to cross the Polish border would face swift and decisive action. Russia has engaged in another alarming incident with a U.S. plane. Just days ago, Ago, a Russian aircraft flew recklessly close to a manned U.S. spy plane operating in Syrian airspace, putting the lives of four American personnel at risk. This occurrence is part of a worrying trend, as Russia seems to be relentlessly pursuing a record of harassment. Throughout this month alone, they have targeted U.S. drones, planes, and troops on at least five occasions, dropping fuel on them, buzzing them, and even releasing flares in dangerous proximity. China's involvement in supplying Russia with military equipment has raised concerns in the international community. China has been providing Russia with dual-use equipment, which has both civilian and potential military applications. For instance, this year alone, Russia has imported over $100 million worth of drones and $225 million of ceramic materials from China. This level of cooperation approaches the red line set by Western nations, including France and the U.S., who have warned China that they rely on the West and will not hesitate to sever ties if they cross this boundary. Boundary. While China's actions suggest they are not a neutral actor, sanctions may not be immediately imposed unless they engage in direct supply of munitions and military equipment to Russia.